Okay, so I just wanted to introduce you guys to UGit, which is a MicroPython module that will clone a repository directly onto a microcontroller. If you put ugit.py onto the board, and then in the boot.py or create your own boot.py, you import it, and then run the command ugit.pullall, it will actually pull the tree from the repository, pull all the files, put it on the board, and reboot the board. So let's hop right into it. The only thing that's on here is a boot.py, and I have ugit on here, the one that's directly off of GitHub. So I'm going to pull the whole repository, which is ugit underscore test. I'll just plug it in in views. And okay. Of course, that's open muscle. There we go. So it should just blink on its own and get everything. If I don't do anything wrong. And it's blinking. Okay, so it's working. So it went ahead and pulled the repository from GitHub onto it. And as you can see, the only thing that's on it is 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 ugit and boot.py that has these two commands. Now, of course, ugit has my SSID and password for the Wi-Fi that I'm using to do this. And it also has the user and repository filled in just the very top of ugit.py. So initially, this is meant to pull the repository directly onto the MicroPython board and run it. We'll see that it is boot, and this is the boot. So what we'll do is, just so you guys can see, I mean, I know you believe me, and the code's live, so go ahead and test it. Uh, you get test, right? We should be able to change the repository and instead of having it blink 10 times, let's have it blink super fast. So I'm gonna commit the changes, and then we'll delete a couple of other things. Just leave some, whatever. Okay, now we're gonna hit reset. That's that way nothing. I have oh so many springs from open muscle. <laughs> You'd be surprised how hard pressed it is to find the right type of spring. Okay, and now it uploaded from GitHub properly this time, and it's blinking very fast. 